Oh, a human. Aline. Inform Barker that whatever we're fighting, it's not the silent ones. Saruk, how can you be so sure? Sir, I've taken a prisoner. It's unlike anything we've encountered before. Bring it to Central. The Council can decide what it There's is. no time! While our forces are evacuating the population, this enemy is draining the catalyst field. Sir, we have received reports of attacks on the main terminal. We need to change our tactics. It's a catalyst they want. I have to confer with your learners. Stand by for orders. And whatever you are, you will not destroy our future. Okay, I noticed the little arms on, on the beta guys. We'll have to do that uh, mission eventually to get the bonus objectives. Sir. No communication from Barker? None. Enemy units up ahead. Directly between us and field command. Can we go round them? No. We must go through them. All right. No turning back. Still no word from Baz Barker. <laughs> the smaller fireball broke up over the wetlands. Nyko is taking force there now. If you keep moving west from your position, you should find the impact point of the larger fireball. Good luck, Sarok. I'll keep you supplied. These I don't look like them, right kids? Um, I like the game quite a bit, uh, Woody. I played a little bit during Alpha, and um, at least the missions are challenging and fun, so... I'll have to see if we can uh, finish the bonus, bonus objective this, on this map. Okay, hey, the battle at the trench. A fireball has hit Beta Field Command, and Saruk scanners have shown a number of landing craft incoming to the planet. This appears to be the start of a major enemy assault. Not knowing who is alive or dead, Saruk sets out to fight his way back to Field Command, only to encounter a completely different enemy. Saruk is determined to fight past the new foe and save who he can before his forces are overwhelmed. So, looks like uh, it's another fight against the odds, Sir, and that's the goo. The okay, yeah, they have high ground advantage too. Jeez, this seems like a tough mission. I'm picking up a surveillance transmission from a perimeter outpost. What is that? Oh, that's some other goo. It ate the buildings. I'm tired of running. I want the hand of Rook up and operational now. Oh sweet, we're, we're already building the main. Oh sweet, we're building the main. Um, um, what do you call it? Uh, heroic, heroic unit. Hand of Rook. It's basically a mobile weapons platform. Or oh, jeez, why? Why did they already send enemies over here? I can't even do anything just yet. But they're already sending enemies. Oh, that's that for you. Okay, we have a little bit of a resource field down here. Check that new position. Check that new location. Predator confirms. Go. Thanks for sticking to the screen, Xbox Zero. Hopefully, you'll get rewarded for with a key Predator soon. Why did you miss uh, my Facebook giveaway today? <clears throat> Let's hunt. Kind of scared to move up with this guy. Get a stalker. Let's get a stalker in the mix, uh, and then we'll send the stalker down to secure this resource location. Building the hand of Rook will require a large hub, which we did not have access to so far, but we will have now. Ready. So I'll keep the stalker. Um, should probably just build a um, small hub already, just so we have it available. And we need to Beginning keep that this time. 
yes. just because we Point. have to. Kind of hate that part. Relocating. Kind of hate that part, to be honest. Um, go for Unit infantry units now. More commandos. Oh, Waiting. that's the next one attacking. Uh, but Radiant, if I remember correctly, they don't do all that much damage. But the thing is, they can um, scout on top of hills. Copy that position. Um, you don't have Facebook. Well, you wouldn't have needed Facebook if you somehow got a way to get in touch with me. But I've not. I've I have played the other races, but not in the campaign. Or is the campaign only beta units? I I have no idea. Is is it just beta units? I think it's probably all factions, right? Unit in production. Oh wow! They already have a huge army attacking on the left side. Are you kidding me? This is nuts. Like, how can I defend this with just so few units? I could have built a few more, but... Are you kidding me? Okay, that's weird. So you need to play this a lot more aggressively. Should we restart? I think we should restart. Because, yeah, they're just gonna overrun us. Okay, so this doesn't work like the multiplayer does. Um, let's just restart the mission. Skip the... Get the other parts here. Um, yeah, this works a lot differently than the multiplayer. At least when we played at Gamescom, it was mostly um, economical openings where you start out um, with two extractors and just scout out your enemy and see what he's doing. But at least in the campaign, it's definitely focused on turtling uh, quite a bit. So um, we'll get started on that first extractor, but then go for a factory as soon as we can. Keep this guy here, and we'll just play the turtle game if they want us to. I'm playing on hard difficulty. And um, to continue on with your question, Woody, I th I, th I like the goo. I think the goo is one of the best races, or not best, but the one that suits my style the most. Uh, I'm uh, also StarCraft caster, and um, on StarCraft I play a Zerg, so they're kind of similar. Not not the same or anything, but. They, have, they share some similarities, it's all about the number game with the goo, but then they're quite distinct, to be honest, um, to um, to other RTS games, like races and other RTS games, since you can move them around and you should move them between resource fields. Uh, the humans were the weakest race in the alpha, since um, like their base building is just incredibly annoying and uh, long distance mining with them is... I don't know, it just didn't seem all that efficient. And I like the beta quite a bit, since they have um, the ability to just build bases anywhere. You don't need to have power connections, just build a hub somewhere you can and you'll be fine. Okay, so now I'll go for a second factory straight away. And then possibly, yeah, no, let's get started with the production here. Get a few of these guys out and let's uh, put a tower. Uh, just close here. Under and I'll Beginning construction. Wait, I'm they're already attacking? This. Wait, this is faster than the last time. Are you kidding me? Even faster than the last time? Under That's attack. insane. Under uh, we'll repair this. But still, I mean, this is this is just so nuts. I will have to switch over to... Um... Are you kidding me? That That's... That's not fair. This, this is impossible to stop at this point. I can set this guy on the wall, but now, once this is done, we don't have any resources to um, mine and do something here. And the predator got killed off before we did anything. Okay, um, I'll switch over to, to normal difficulty. This is not working. Maybe something triggered that shouldn't have at that point, because no way you can stop that at this point. I did everything cor correctly this time. Built two factories, got production started, only a single extractor. Um, okay, skip that, we'll switch to normal. Yeah, you're speaking to an RTS person. I've not played StarCraft in a while, but I, I do still cast it um, every couple of weeks or so. Like, uh, two weeks ago I casted like three or four days of StarCraft. Um, and I think I'll cast um, another round of StarCraft next week on Tuesday. Okay, let's skip the intro. Let's go straight for that extractor. 
will not waste any more time. I know the first Radiant comes from this side, so we'll place down our Predator on that side. And put the factory down as soon as we can. I'm not wasting a second here. Not even a second. Okay, get that next factory out. And this one should supply us with uh, enough units for the start. Yeah, we have to exchange Steam IDs, uh, Judo. So we can get the match going. How do you like it? I didn't watch your entire stream yesterday, so I only got the first impression. Oh, this time the rating came from down here. Okay, yeah, let's get the next factory out, or maybe... Let's see, we're still gaining resources. But, I don't know, if I get the next factory out... It might stop or halt production on this one. Minus two per sec. That's with building the factory. I think it was still good. I think we're still good. Um, the goo being OP. Well, I don't know. I mean, I think in our matches, um, back in the alpha, I mean, they changed things quite a bit. As you can see, like the previous map I played, I tried to get the stealth attachment uh, for the stalkers, which uh, was a bad idea since the stealth attachment was completely changed. Now it only works while they're moving, which is kind of useless, um, to be honest. Like, I don't really see the point, but um, that's also with me not playing all that much, so... Um, I'll have to see. And in, in the alpha matches we played, um, human was vastly inferior. Oh, not vastly inferior, but um, kind of inferior, um, except for one single tactic, getting um, getting the... Um, which, which tech upgrade was it? Can I check the encyclopedia while I'm in the game? Uh, I might be able to... Oh, it's probably over here. So yeah, humans, um, you get the, um, you get longbows and you get, which tech was it, um, longbow, yeah, this, yeah, longbows can now target enemies on the ground and they have an insane range, they can still move while firing and that was just batshit crazy. Yeah, notice I, I still tuned into your stream while you had performance issues. Oh wait, I did make one mistake here. I should have gotten turret up. So um, let's get that established now, and let's put it over here somewhere. We don't want to lose the predator just yet, so we can't since we can't build any more. I'll establish that so we can actually build some more and we've had that distracted. So you can see I changed my tactic quite a bit, um, playing a little bit more defensive now, like crazy more defensive. And once we have this base somewhat secured, that's when I'll go for uh, stalled economy. Well, you don't say. Pause this. Actually, let's pause both of these so we can get our walls and walls and stuff up. Uh, would it be useful to actually place a wall down there? No, I don't think that's actually all that useful. Just stick to the wall. Uh, stick to the walls we have, and let's go for predator production now. Okay. And we want to get the next predator out, and then we can resume this one. And then I think we should try to move out and secure another resource location. Wall complete. A lot of things are unintuitive. Um, I think with Goo some of the stuff was, was unintuitive, but then again, um, I think if you play the tutorials and play the campaign, it probably gets introduced. And also, I'm not checking any of these things since I'm just assuming that I know them already. I don't know if I really do, but who knows. Okay, so we have that wall established and the Predator on. Um, just Oh jeez, they have uh, destroyers Unit now. Stalker, check. So, Get yep, that's right. our second predator, let's get that on the wall. And let me just click on here so it disappears. Is there any way to... Ah, okay, minimize the turtles, we don't really want away. them blocking our way. Stop production here, and let's go for 
a resource hub down here. Beginning construction. Tank attachment um, predators volley shots is reduced to single Unit fire shots, allowing them to retarget each shot as needed. It's costing quite a bit, and we're losing or, uh, we're losing resources already. So it's also a hard key Unit to set them on hold position. I'll check out what that is. Stop command S. Guard is G. So G or hold ground. Which one was hold ground? H. I don't know if these are on here as well. It's a ping. Doesn't look like it is. I just need a target. Okay, sweet. Ready. We got our first Ready. predator in the mix. Small hub complete. Okay, we got that first hub established. There's nothing down here. Um, I'll just go for just a single turret, and we'll get a predator down here to save it. I mean the. I was kind of surprised in that last mission, having the towers available and just putting a single predator on there worked out quite well. Really surprised. Construction so let's get this predator down here. We'll add this guy to our army again. And they're attacking on the top. Okay, did I? I pr might have already sent this guy to... Okay, come on, move down here. And I'll get you up in the mix here. Yeah, okay. finally fix that. Okay, yeah, so hopefully this uh, production gets started here pretty soon. Yep, it's almost done, so... This is something I should watch out for, like not over um, overextending my resource, um, uh, resource income when I'm building like these vital buildings. Oh gosh, that's a pretty large, large army already. But I think with a tower, we should be able to stop it. We lost our entire army, but I think this one predator should be fine on the wall. Since I need to destroy the wall first, and I'll just repair it. And you can see it does quite a bit of damage to the destroyers. These radius can't really do all that much. And, oh, we still have a single predator down here. Let's save this guy. We'll just keep him behind the walls. Okay, I think we're good. And let's get this guy up on the wall. Uh, maybe we can get close to this resource field. I would quite like that. Wait, there's a mission timer? Oh gosh, are you kidding me? Oh wow. Okay, um, didn't really notice that. Destroy all crescent units. Okay. Okay, so we kind of have to move out now since, uh, yeah, that's pretty much... Upgrade. Pretty much vital to Unit do something here. Unit ready. Unit introduction. Predators on land. Okay, it's, is this Predators high ground vision? Go. No, right uh, I don't think it is. Okay, so this is a huge resource oh, field. Um, oh, we'll get the first one up and running. Okay, why can I build anything? weird. Okay, Beginning that's good enough. I think it should be good enough at least. Oh no, wait, last time we Unit had get some issues Unit when we put it down like this. Okay, where can we put it down? There's no real safe Unit spot, it seems. Taking fire. Beginning construction. Okay. Unit ready. Unit uh, introduction. Q or Q. Let's get this guy over here. Beginning wait, only a single predator left? Are you kidding me? We need to secure this location. Hopefully we can put them up on the wall pretty soon here. Unit ready. Unit introduction. Beginning construction. Okay, production wise, uh, we're in a good spot now, or at least a better spot. Let's get this guy up on the wall. And once we have this established, I'll just go for a um, bigger hub. We don't quite have enough to build that large hub just yet. Yeah, that's good. Now we can put this guy on here. Perfect. Perfect. This uh, part of the map should be somewhat secure now. And we're exactly at zero resource income. I like this. Okay, um, we'll go for artillery and tank attachments on here. And then build a large factory on both sides. So we will have a lot of income now. 
Okay, this guy shouldn't pass through. No, of course he can't. Sweet. Okay, income wise, we're in a good spot. Let's finally go for. Oh, Unit we actually ready. started on it. Sweet. Even better. Even better. Okay. We'll build. add to this army. Form up. Just Let's form up and move. get it across the trench. Where's that Medium trench at? Hub complete. Unit ready. Unit in production. Okay, we'll try to find our way down here Let's and then. Let's write history. Right now we don't have any defense at home, but I hope that just having our bases um, somewhat spread out helps in uh, finding out about these guys before they get to us. Okay, that looks like a weird crop circle. Uh, and this is all high ground. Okay, let's go for a tiny hub over here. Artillery attachment. Complete. Tank attachment complete. Okay, we don't have that much space. I'll just go here. Construction. Oh wow, that's that's a huge army. Yeah, we definitely need more guys over here. Harvester under Come on. Tank tech upgrade complete. Unit ready. But you see how this helps out immensely. Just this one wall is somehow keeping the space safe a little bit at least. Now we have the remaining army coming in. So. Large factory complete. I won't be able to build it until we get there. And then I'll probably need to secure it with another tower. But I think that's okay. Small hub complete. And Unit ready. Unit in production. 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 Okay, more guys, more guys. Um, should probably start production over here as well. Um, we'll add some hailstorms to the mix. Um, okay. And more predators. We'll just go for a crazy amount of predators. And let's find... Oh, yeah. We can go for the big hand of Rook. And that's a good spot. Looks like a good spot. Now I'm not quite certain which attachments we needed though. Probably two... Unit ready. Yeah, Unit I think it works production. like this. You need two Beginning large factories. And now you need Unit each... Um, Beginning construction. One of each of these tech Beginning attachments. If I remember correctly, yeah, that looks good. Now Let once that's done, me. we can get started Let on Hand of Rook. And it actually takes quite a while to build. Okay, production-wise, we're in a good spot, and after this, we can go for um, go for that upgrade I talked about last time. That seeker upgrade, but 22 minutes—that's not too long. Um, oh, jeez, they're finally attacking this thing. And it's already unpowered. I didn't watch out whatsoever when building this. But our units get there, and oh, geez, he already destroyed again. Wow. Did he? Yeah. He did. Okay. Um, I'll get a tower down here so we can defend this. Oh wow. Oh wow. They have artillery now. This is awful. Um. Artillery is seriously the worst thing that can happen to you. The goo artillery, they um, throw these balls of goo that just um, go on top of your units, do massive amounts of damage and slow them down. So essentially they just eat them up with the goo. And that's, that's truly awful, believe me. Okay, I'll save. Um... Xbox Zero, it's, it's better than SC2. I don't know, I mean, it's it's quite a bit different. I mean, SC2 is a lot faster. It's also more of a um, uh, macro and micro-oriented game, whereas here it's more about grand strategy. Oh, not grand strategy, that's a totally different genre, but... Um, okay, let's save this army. I just... I have to be so incredibly careful with that... Um, with that final, um, that final strike from the artillery. 
Maybe we should ready. go for a repair Unit pad. What do we Unit need? Ready. A hanger? Why would you need a hanger for a Unit repair pad? Ready for that makes Get no five, sense. Okay, we have Stalker. You have a minutes. Small hub complete. Okay, that large hub is done. Most of the factories aren't though. So I have to see. I don't want to go crazy overboard with this. Unit ready. These guys are still not done. All units. Check. Moving to Unit under attack. Group maneuver. Oh, jeez. Now they're attacking from top again? Oh, this guy can take care of it. It's okay. That's alright. Quite alright. Uh, yeah. They still have artillery down here. So, what do we do about artillery? I need something to actually scout out the top of all of this. So, I think we will have to go for air somehow. Okay, let's go for um, a medium hub. Should be fine. And then we'll build the air pad. Okay, we'll build the air pad somewhere. It's gonna be over here. Maybe we can just go for that R for the uh, for the other one. And now we just want to build the Stratus, and with the Stratus we don't need anything. So I'm just building it so we have high ground uh, high ground vision to clear out the. The artillery on the hills, because that's one of the uh, specialties about the goo. They can, they can just go on top of hills with their artillery, and I think also the radiant can do it, or at least they can see on top of hills. I'm not sure if they are actually able to cl uh, climb on top of them as well. Okay, so let's go for the seeker stealth. Still losing money for some reason. This refinery is working, so we need more stuff. More stuff, okay. We can do that. Let's go for more stuff. Unit ready. Unit in production. Beginning construction. Okay, that's too close again. He's making the same mistakes over and over. Um, so, refinery. Go for one on this side. Okay. Ten. More production. I like this. Uh, they're attacking the wall again. Oh, this guy's not sitting on top of it. That makes sense then. Now he has the range to do it and attack this guy. But we still don't have high ground vision, so I'm kind of risking a lot by just moving out like that. Yep, and that's exactly what's happening here. So we'll we'll have to do something about this. We'll lose way too much though. If to get too close. Oh yeah, and the artillery, of course, they can reach to the extractors. That's awesome. Uh, they're sitting on top of something here, and it's probably doing too much damage to this outside base. Um, how long are we on that stealth attack? Yeah, that's on the way. How's our hangar doing? Let's get a first stratus in the air. Scars are kind of cheap, so we can build them up. Yeah, this this base was not a good idea. Do we have something else where we can build more bases up here? Send a single unit up there. Um, do we have a unit up somewhere. Oh, why is this guy jump down? Yeah, so this was taken out. I'm not gonna repair it for now, since the artillery is just gonna shoot it anyways. And then, okay, this guy. I'll send you over here. Get that Whoa, first extractor attack. established. Unit okay, ready. Stratus, come on. Keep the Unit Stratus ready. up there. By the way, if you uh, guys like the cast, or not the cast, but stream rather, uh, don't forget to follow me here on Twitch, and I also upload all of my casts and streams to YouTube, so it's also up there. And in the coming days, we'll be giving away more Heroes of the Storm keys, so we're looking forward to Blizzard's next. Uh, big game. We don't have access just yet. Should tune in. Yeah, we have quite a big army now. Um, actually, getting close to the pop limit. So uh, we're also running out of time now. I just need that Stratus in the air. And once we have the Stratus, yeah, we have two Stratus now. I'll add them to our army mix, and now we have something to. Look up in the air and see their. Oh, geez, yeah, this is awful. 
Still need to get out of there. Look at that. I mean, look at the range of that. That's insane. And we'll secure this one as well. Okay. Uh, we should have vision now, but I still don't know where they're at. Um, wait. Let's not go with the entire army. Let's just get the Stratus in here. Okay, Cold Stratus. Let's scout everything out. They're over here somewhere. Oh, that's. Tempus, they can shoot air. Where's the artillery at? As far as I know, there's no way for Goo to um, cloak all of their units. Okay. I don't find the artillery for some reason. Oh, there they are. Wait, that's an insane reach. Are you kidding me? They must have an artillery somewhere else. It's insane. That's an insane reach. Let's keep these guys in the back. Are they attacking someone else? Okay, I think we finally have the reach on here. We're gonna lose quite a bit. But I think we should get in range of the artillery pretty soon. Where is... Uh, geez, did we lose vision again? I just have to keep him on the move if that's the case. And, uh... Oh jeez, we're gonna lose way too much up here. We need more Stratus in the air. Come on, get down there. Uh, I'll just go for... Um, never any production on Stratus. We'll finally have more income. Uh, let's build the Hand of Rook. Almost forgot about that. Yeah, we lost our entire army to just a few artillery units. That's insane. And this guy has an insane, insane reach. Uh, we lost the next Stratus. Wow. Like he, he can reach from over here way to over here. Um, maybe we should have gone for Nimbus Bombers. Now we're losing way too much. I don't think we can actually make this. Check. Where's that Unit chasm? Unit introduction. Or the trench, rather. Check. There aren't that many good units. If we could just Check. get close to... If we could just one. get close to, um, to the artillery action. units, we would be fine, but like this? Why would we need to clear this one? Oh, come on, that's the next one. And look at that. Almost all of my units out of health so soon. Okay, and these guys, just keep these guys on move. Okay, we'll rally this guy over here. I think for the Nimbus, you don't need, um, you don't need a landing hangar. It's probably the same artillery unit we had on the other side. Nope, that's a new one. Okay, we marked it now. So, oh, come on, Nimbus, uh, Stratus Bombers. Stratus, Stratus, get out of the way. Okay, we finally found this guy. And the other one is over here, so let's get rid of him as well. Oh, sweet. Should be fine killing this one. Okay, once you get to them, they aren't that bad to kill off, but you need to get to them first. So that's that's the worst part. Unit ready. Unit introduction. And now they kill off our bombers again, uh, our our flying units. Uh, there should be more on the way though. Refinery under attack. Awaiting instructions. Unit under attack. One. We have that place surrounded. We just need another air unit to scout it out. Come on. Unit in 
As long as we don't have that, I'll just keep them on the move. They don't have that many units, but the artillery is just killing me here. Does anyone know if if there's a good way to get rid of the artillery? Other than just using Stratus Bombers to scout it out. Okay, we'll move over here again. Oh, yeah. There. Oh, no. Not you again. Does it do splash? It looks like it does splash. Okay, where's that last guy? What's one over here? Up oh, there he is. Okay, ten minutes. How far along is the hand of Luke? Two minutes. Okay. Interesting. Okay, that's that's definitely the focus targets here. The artillery, they're just insane. I think that's the last of their artillery. Oh, finally. Okay. Now that we have the artillery cleared out, let me just save that game. Um, is Regu worth the money? Well, from the missions I've played so far, they're a lot of fun. Um, the campaign seems to be well made. We haven't tried out the multiplayer just yet. We'll probably do that maybe on, on Friday. Uh, we'll have to see. Um, but so far it's a lot of fun, yeah. Okay, this seems to be their main building, or that's that's some other goo. That's some other goo. Let's kill these small guys though. And also, um, let's get a second force over here on this side. Oh wait, do they have more units over here? I might need to watch out. Destroy all mother goos. Oh wait, I need to destroy the mother goo? Okay, that's the secondary objective. Come on, one more shot. Uh, what I did here is just to um, establish step them, because if you let them get too close, they slow down your units and eat them up. Okay, extreme firepower, that's probably our hand of roof. Yeah, that's probably our hand of rook. Okay, these guys over here. Unit ready. Unit in production. Unit ready. Unit in production. Oh wait, I uh, made a mistake. Stratasis should be on number three. And we'll just add these guys to number one. But I think we're good. We don't. We need to get the hand of rock through this trench now before we are overwhelmed. Okay. Uh, I think we need to hurry up a little bit here, but the Hand of Rook is just Unit taking forever ready. to get Unit finished. Um, on my location. Last Mother Goo is probably on the top over here. Check. I'll um, halt production on everything Unit now, so we can get the Hand of Rook finished. Um, okay, now we Copy. have reached the population cap and the Hand of Rook is almost done. Sweet. We need to get the Hand of Rook to the other end of this trench. Start of something epic. That's the achievement, not bad. And we'll get a couple of predators on there as well, and then move that hand of rook. It's, it's taking forever though, so this is still going to be tough to make it in time. That's for sure. I mean, this uh, we still have seven minutes to get over here, but wow. Um, oh wow! Oh, this is killing our units. Okay, that's new. Okay. Um, we have a couple of predators down here, yeah. Let's get these on top of the Hand of Rook. And they keep, keep it safe. And then... Oh wow, they're sending a lot of units now, what the heck? Okay, how do I target this again? Why can't I target it for some reason? I can't... Oh, it's also a weapons platform, like, it produces stuff. So we'll go for more production then. Uh, I have no idea how I can use that uh, nuke on the hand of Rook though. That's one thing we're missing right now. 
Okay, this is producing at full capacity. Oh. At least it's not damaging my own units, that's how it works, okay. So we have six minutes to get there. Still have a lot of units in the back. And I like that we have a small force down here, because this helps out and sends the nuke over. Yeah. Good thing it's not doing damage to our own units. Otherwise, uh, yeah, we... Would have been in trouble. But we should be fine like this. I don't know where the final mother goose are though. If if this is the only one, we should be fine. Oh sweet. Still five minutes. That's not a lot of time. This thing is moving so incredibly slow. And if it's always stopping, I'll probably just have to micro it. Okay, I need to get rid of these guys. Oh, are you kidding me? Um, I think that's not gonna be able. To, we're not gonna be able to finish it in time. Okay, let's get that on the way. Uh, do we have enough units to stop this? Problem is we can't really get close since um, since these goo nests are still in the way. And as long as they are in the way, we can't get on top of all of this. I think we might be able to get in touch now. Oh, they are the goo nests over here. Okay. At least it's not Unit taking ready. that much damage. Unit introduction. Okay, I need to move these Unit guys closer. Instruct, Commander. Okay, this is... Honor. Wow. Will. Last minute Instruct thing, that's for sure. Unit ready. Okay, let's move it closer. Move these guys closer. We just have Unit to inch our way forward here. All units. Check. Well Unit under okay. Okay, ready. good, 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 good. Next one. It's another guru nest. Let's get rid of that one. It's powerful, but is it powerful enough? Oh, they're attacking the hand of Rook again. Three minutes. Three minutes to go. Oh, I think we might be able to make it. Where's that final mother of goo? It was around here somewhere. It used to be here. Where did they place it down? He must have moved it for some reason. We still have two minutes, so I can play around for a little bit. Try to search it. Move all of our stuff over here. We'll get, get the Hand of Rook in position, but just not close enough. Oh, there's our fine Mother of Goo. Can that Hand of Rook reach that far? That would be awesome. Yes! We got the bonus objective! Sweet! And looks like we can finish the main objective as well. Whew, at least it was possible in normal mode. <laughs> Jeez, okay. Alright, let's finish the mission. Just Sir, 1 minute and 30 seconds to go. Headquarters? Leave it. Get the men into the pass. The rescue op is our top priority. Yeah! Alright. This was tough. But I like, I like how it works. I mean, this was normal. Uh, like, on hard, for some reason, it triggered too many enemies in the beginning. Like, way too much for you to handle. Um, but on normal, uh, it was still kind of, uh, still kind of tough, but we managed to do it just, just barely. 
So that's it for Grey Goo for me for tonight, but um, I'll be streaming some more Grey Goo, that's for sure. I'll definitely finish the campaign and also do some uh, skirmish matches, so if you have the game...